What's up everybody? I've got some explaining to do because it's been a long time since I've put a vlog out here. I do have an excuse. I don't know if it's a great one, but finally we're back. You are here on Word of Life Island and you're overdue for an update. That and more in this episode. Okay, so here's the thing. There's this little tiny piece that I need to get all the footage from my camera to my computer. And I lost mine. I couldn't find it. I ordered new ones off of Amazon and then they were shipping here. And then all of a sudden it said, this shipment has been delayed. And so it has taken a long, long time for me to just get a simple little SD card for my computer, but nonetheless, I have it now. I actually filmed a whole nother vlog episode. Welcome to another episode of the Island Vlog, and it never even made it because I couldn't get it onto my computer. But here we are, it's week four. It's our biggest week of the summer. We actually have the Ridge campers here this week, as well as the Island, so middle school and high school here together for one giant week of the summer. So much has been going on. I'm gonna show you some of it right now. We're just gonna walk around camp and see what happens. So come on, let's see what's going on. I'm out here at the RC car track. If you remember when we were down at Fox and Friends, we showed you a brand new type of RC car. It's actually a rock crawler and it's not about going fast, it's about going up things and so. We actually added that to this part of the RC car track right here. You can see cool things like there's this little teeter-totter, little bridge, all kinds of stuff. Same over here, we actually added a, a clay surface. This is for uh, racing RC cars. Over here you can see the brand new White House court. We still have to get the painting on it. It doesn't have any lines or anything yet, but funny story about that. You have to have a few days of dry weather in order for them to put this down. And we have not had two days back to back where it has not absolutely poured rain in a long time. More about that a little bit later, but you can see here, we got rid of the fence over here, planted some grass. We got nine square going on, basketball going on. Also, you guys haven't even seen this because I talked about it in the last video, but we have a brand new cabin going up. It's right over here on the back side. I'll take you over there and show it to you. I'm gonna do a whole nother episode about this cabin. It's kind of loud over here right now, but a uh, brand new cabin right over here, just being built. Check back in for another episode for more about that. But let's keep walking around the island. We're up here at top of the rock, snack shack, camp store. One of my favorite things we added this year, these lights. I'll have to show you them at night. They're not as cool right now, but such a fun effect. We also added some lights back up in here. So yeah, not much has changed at top of the rock. It's just rocking like normal. All right, I'm over here. This is the dining hall. Brand new addition over here. Look at this. Dining hall restroom. Girls bathroom, guys bathroom. Right here next to the dining room. So convenient now if you have to go to the bathroom before, after, during the meal. It's right there. It's like 10 steps outside. I'm out here at the roof. A brand new pavilion over the basketball court. It's so awesome. Let me tell you what. This pavilion has been just perfect for us. It has rained so much this summer and we've had that. So we can keep all the activities going. We can play our sports tournaments. It's been so clutch. And so we're so grateful for the roof. We still have to finish the court. Same problem we're having over at the White House court. We just need dry weather to do it. But we are playing on in the meantime and it has just been so perfect for us. So that's a little update on the roof. You guys have kind of seen that, followed that progress all along. Here's a zip liner. Just camps in full swing out here. 
All right, so I'm down here at the beach. Well, what's left of the beach? The water is so high because it has rained here, the equivalent of Noah's flood type of rain. You can see normally the beach is like way out here. And today it is basically where the beach volleyball court is. I mean, look at, normally there's sand all the way out to there and it's all just underwater. We've had so much rain, but one of the best parts about this summer is we added a place to buy snacks at the beach. It's right down here. This used to be a place where we stored stuff and people actually lived in here. And now there's a little snack shack right here. Okay. I'm down here at the brand new beach snack shop. They got, look, I don't know if you can see that. Mochi ice cream. This is what it looks like. And I can't try them all, but I recruited some help and these guys are going to try them. So here's the strawberry one. Don't, don't eat it yet though. Sweet mango. Double chocolate. Are you allergic to chocolate? Okay. Don't worry. This is so nice because you used to have to walk all the way up to the snack shack to get something cold. They got, that you can do lemonade, that you can get all kinds of syrups. Let me see, we got, what kind of syrups do we got here? Raspberry, hibiscus, lavender, passion fruit, mango, peach, sugar-free raspberry. We got all kinds of syrups to add in and it's so refreshing. We also have some other things you can get sparkling water, regular water, Gatorade, all of that right down here in close proximity to the beach. Don't try them yet, guys. We gotta wait until we can all try this together. Okay, here's another one. Strawberry. You got another double chocolate. Double chocolate. I knew it. Here's the cookies and cream. Okay, this is my favorite flavor, cookies and cream. It's good. Yo, this is good. Mm -hmm. That is good. Mm -hmm. The mango? Mm, that's good. Water. That is actually pretty good. What, what's your review on it? You like it? Five, five out, out of five. Five out of five, all right. Yeah. yeah, five out of five. So good. There you go. All that and more. Stop by at the Beach Snack Shack. You might hang out with these guys. You'll at least get some good mochi ice cream, yes, some lemonade, whatever you got. All right, that's all we got for the Beach Snack Shack. One more time, I'm just gonna show you where this beach level is at. I mean, look at this. For those of you who have been on the island before, you can appreciate just how crazy this is. And then on top of that, we got the wildfire smoke from Canada out here. We can barely see any of those mountains. How we are at flood stage and in Canada, there's still wildfires, I don't understand. But that is the world that we are living in right now. I think that's gonna be it for this episode. I'm gonna show you a picture of the boathouse just so you can see how high the water level is right now. Maybe I'll throw in a picture of how it was before, but you also get a little sneak peek of the newly renovated boathouse, which I'm gonna have to do a whole episode down there too, now that we've finished it. But um, that's what I got for you. Little update, here we are, week four, biggest week of the summer. Of course, we always appreciate it when you like, comment, if you haven't subscribed yet, subscribe to our YouTube channel. Not only are you gonna get the Week in Review video every week, you're gonna get content, from this summer you're also going to get vlogs that are updating you on the projects that are going on so if you haven't subscribed yet definitely do that hit the bell turn on notifications that's what we got thank you for tuning in to this episode of the island vlog